Hey guys, welcome back to the MyGo YouTube channel. Got another super cool light here today. It's the CeraVision UV420. This is basically a UVB Canon. It's 450 watts uh, grow light, which, you know, when you compare against your 20 watt, 40 watt fluorescent UVB tubes, this thing is just an absolute monster. Similar to light emitting plasma, which has been out and around for some time. High efficiency plasma has greater ability to get that UVB out. And as I said, this thing is a monster. I'm gonna go through the, the uh, tests I've done uh, later, but we just go over some of the features. So it's a big brute of a thing, as I said, um, weighs about 10 kilos. You can see the size, sort of a, a foot and a half or 400 mil by a foot deep here. And we've got a fan cooled unit up on top. We've got a magnetron, which is very cool, uh, which produces yeah, radio frequency or microwaves. And you can see under here, we've got uh, the little bulb. It's a resonator. And inside that resonator, we've got a mixture of gases, metal and metal halides and those uh, are all illuminated by this plasma and it emits a very unique spectrum. So as you can see there's a, there's a certain amount of blue light and I've tested that. You, we get about 120 uh, par in blue light. This light is really designed to work in conjunction with others so it complements for example the HPS spectrum very well. Um, I believe they're also working on an LED complementary light as well, um, the guys in Saravision. But really it's all about the UVA and UVB. And as I said, this thing is, a, is an absolute monster. Um, what we've, uh, we, we tested it on a relatively low target area. It should really be about maybe uh, two meters above the grow area. Uh, and distributing over about 100 square feet, so about, um, what's that, about 3 meters by 3 meters. Um, but in this case I was just capturing it over a, a, a small area, but still very, very impressive. Um, just to put it in perspective, you know, a, a 50 watt, 40, 50 watt fluorescent um, would be able to output about 1 watt of UVA and B. Um, this one is able to output about seven and a half, eight watts of UVA and B, which is a huge um, quantity. And most importantly, it's able to output about uh, three and a half of that uh, eight watts or thereabouts in UVB, which is huge. There's, uh, there's pretty much no other sources out there that are able to um, provide so much UVB. From a pricing point of view, it's not available on retail yet. But uh, you can contact the guys in Saravision for a quote directly. Um, it's in and around twice the price of, for example, the Gavita light emitting, emitting, emitting plasma, which is 270 watts. So at, uh, at nearly twice the wattage, it's, it's around the same price per watt as the um, Gavita light emitting plasma. Um, and yeah, hoping to head over to Saravision to see the guys. Big thanks to Sean for sending me this unit over. I've now gathered together some more UV sources, uh, the Solicure uh, Flower Power, and the HTG Agrimax, uh, some Philips and Osram fixtures. And I'm getting a special UVB sensor, um, can detect UVB only, and I'm gonna do a big overview of all these lights and just give you one final um, overview and recommendation on um, UVB sources. In the meantime, if any questions or comments, please let me know. Take care.